Hi, right, Mr. Battle. Good evening to you. Uh, my name is Bobby Fernanda. I've been basically coaching from the early 70s. Uh, been at it for quite some time. Hopefully this is my last time around. Expectations from this trip? Well, I haven't been on the tour for quite some time. I really don't know what to expect other than tough competition. The level of play we're going up against should be very, very tough. I know it's going to be tough, so we're going to go there and do our best and uh, see how best we can put the right players in the right spot and get the best results. Anthony Bullitt, I've uh, been coaching over 20 some years. Um, right now, in the back of me, I have the national team. This is the third national team I've been on. Coaching, um, we're heading to Canada, hoping to go to World Games. Um, we got a lot of talents, uh, a lot of them. Um, it's a little early now, so just about a couple of minutes, everybody will be here. Um, Bela Fernandez, the head coach. Uh, we got um, Shane Albury, and you have also Ms. Lockhart. Um, we're laying free port, so um, we're just dealing with what we have here. Um, they pretty good. You know, we get a, a good young crew with us. You know, and hopefully, uh, with the training with Bela Fernandez and Shane Albury and myself and Ms. Lockhart, we will go far. Isabel, you just don't pick up people, park them together and send them off to play and expect good results. That, that ain't how this thing is done. We need to be together more often. Game situations. Waking out is one thing, but game situation is totally different. That's what we haven't been able to do. That has always been one of the problems of the Bahamas Softball Federation. There's never enough funds for us to bring all the people together and take them off and uh, let them get exposure together. So, my thing is, we need a big sponsor. I would say to the president of softball, you need to go out and get a big sponsor and ask this sponsor, present the sponsor with a situation that he or she could come out good for their company and it'll be good for us. He'll get something in return. Whatever we do, we we'll carry their flag, their well, we probably can't put their name, but just a little patch on our uniforms. But we'll take them around the world with us, and we'll do our best on and off the field, not to embarrass them, not to embarrass ourselves, but to do good for all three of us, ourselves, softball, and the company. Okay, you know, we are our girls. We play, most of them play in two leagues. Uh, you got slow pitch and uh, fast pitch. One or two playing inside Bankers uh, um, League. It's not enough games, uh, you know, we might play 20, 20 games the most, you know, we might go one or two tournaments, you know, but um, you got like the United States or Canada, they go to 40 different tournaments and stuff, it's not enough, you know, to even get them there, but um, we'll be proud of our girls because, you know, they right there playing in the couple of tournaments we have. Um, um, uh, we have here, like, uh, after you play in the tournament here, we play the wild, uh, what you call it, uh, championship, from what, what championship to move on, Grand Robin, you know, it's not that much, you know, but then that's for them to move up, you know, uh, but they keep them in shape. But other than that, it's not much to do, right? We don't go to different tournaments, right, if we get a chance to go to different tournaments, other than the one coming up. Right, and then you have to prepare yourself to go to that tournament. Where she, you can't carry 20 girls or 25 girls, but you know, we only carry 15 girls. We might carry, well, we can try to carry a little over. You know, but um, we carry 15 girls, but it's a lot. And, and it's hard to carry out of 25 girls to cut 15. You know, but uh, we gotta do what we have to do. You know, because the United States, you know, they carry like. They ask for 15, they carry 30. Small country like us only could carry 15, might carry a little over, you know, for experience or something like that. You know, that's what we go for. We carry more. You know, we carry more and somebody get hurt. Our advantage, I mean, help us out a bit. Our advantage will help us a lot. You know, but um, we can see what we can do. You know. When I was in school, I don't know if anything changed, and three teams will advance from each of the continents, which produces 21 teams. 
and the host club will automatically make 22. So we'll be divided up in probably three groups, A, B, C, and we'll go from there. But to think it can't happen, you can't leave home saying it can't happen. You have to always be positive that the possibility exists. But you know you're leaving home in hot water. So what are you going to do? You're going to fight your way out. That's the best I can do. Just keep fighting hard, pushing the girls to fight hard.